welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited for today's video. Bright and early in the morning, but I wanted to give you guys a little insight on what's going on today. If you guys missed the last video, make sure you guys check it out. We literally ripped up my mom's kitchen. And what I mean by that is, oh my goodness, Michelle and I dug through those drawers and we found expired food from 2017. Sorry, mom, to blast you like that. She really needed a detox in that kitchen. And the reason that I wanted to do that is because I am remodeling her whole entire kitchen. I'm so, so excited. I've been wanting to do this for a very long time. I always told myself, we moved into this house in 2012. Comment down below if you guys have been following me for that long. If you guys have been watching my videos since 2014, when I used to live at home, when I was going to college, even when I graduated from college, when I was filming mukbangs in my bedroom, when I was cooking ramen and seafood in my mom's kitchen, comment down below. Let me know if you guys have been around for that long. I cannot believe I've been making YouTube videos for seven years now. That is just so, so wild to me. You know, I am all about my mother. I was raised by a single mother. I love her dearly. She has taught me to be the strong woman that I am today. And she has gone through a lot of struggles in her life for me to have the life that I do now. And I'm very grateful for everything that she's taught me. And I always told myself I work hard so my mom can have nice things. I am all about my mother. I love her dearly. And so I always told myself when we moved into that house in 2012, I always said I am going to remodel my mom's kitchen. And so the day has finally come. We've saved up enough money. We are there, you guys. We are giving back to to our mothers and it is truly the most surreal best feeling in the world that I'm able to do this for my mom she means the world to me and so today we are starting renovation we're ripping up everything you guys are gonna see the final results at the end of the video it is going to be amazing and I'll also be back later on this week as well so we'll get updates on the kitchen and stuff and see how she likes it I also wanted to put in a quick message it is so important to give back to your parents you guys you know our parents have gone through so much to give us the life that we do have right now and I am just so thankful and grateful for my mom so always think about your parents as we get older I know you know things go crazy and, and time flies by and we become busy with our own lives we have our kids we have our you know husbands wives marriages we have businesses to run we have homes to take care of we become adults and sometimes that means we become really busy but don't forget your roots don't forget to make time for your parents as we get older our parents are also getting older so make time for them you are capable of making time in your own schedule or give back in any way that you can and then in a few days I am also redoing her garage her garage door is literally falling apart and she refuses to redo the garage door she thinks that a few screws is gonna help but no that garage door is done I opened it the other day it was about to collapse we're also taking rid or getting rid of all of her vertical blinds she has these like vertical blinds from like the 1950s and so we're gonna remove them and put I think new curtains I believe or we might look into maybe new vertical blinds but I haven't decided yet. I am so thankful to be in a position where I'm able to give back to my mom. She deserves the world and thank you to you guys for watching my videos and supporting me all through these seven years. I am so grateful for you guys. It's been so great to get to grow up with you but yes we are about to head out and this is what I'm wearing today. It is getting cold outside you guys so yeah we're about to head out now but first and foremost I wanted to show you guys something that I was obsessed with last month, but now I'm like officially obsessed with. So if you guys remember in one of my vlogs last month, I tried this perfume for the very first time. And let me tell you, I am so, so excited that I am holding a full size in my hand right now. If you guys don't know about Scentbird, check them down below. That's how I discovered this perfume. It is called Confessions of a Rebel Morning After. It is so, so good. Very different from things that I usually wear. I usually wear things that are very like girly and fresh like fresh linen very dainty this is rebellious it's chic it reminds me of just like New York City like I don't know why I think of New York City because when I think chic I just think of like fashion and I just think of being in all black and wearing this and just ah oh, being so rebellious it is so different for me and I love it so much and I'm very excited to share it with you guys today I'll have the links down below you can also get 20% off by the way with the discount code Kim Tai 20% off at confessionsofarebel.com like I said I'll have the link down below for 
for you guys. They also sent over a few other things for me to try, which I'm very, very thrilled about. So basically the whole idea about this is confessions of a rebel, like unleash your rebellious side. Like we all, you know, have done things in our lives that we're not so proud of, you know, like me. Used to sneak out of my mom's house in high school to meet my boyfriends at one in the morning. I feel like I'm safe. I'm in the safe zone now. You know, I'm 28. Oh my God, I'm 28. I just turned 28 last week, you guys. I'm still getting used to telling people that I'm 28. I still feel like I'm 27. But we have all done something in our lives that's a little bit rebellious and some of us don't, don't wanna talk about it. I feel like I'm in the safe zone, you know? I'm 28 now. I can easily just like talk about things I've done Sorry, mother. But they also have other ones. They have Confessions of a Rebel Special Edition Trio Gift Set. This is what it is right here. This first one is called Get a Room. And then we have Love High. And then we have Bitch Please. Oh my God, do you guys love love the names and what i love about this is that it's just not for me carlos can also use it so for you and your man it's not too feminine but it's not too masculine it's like the perfect perfect combination it also says that confessions of a rebel is doing it locally on a global scale collaborating with the best and the brightest small batch farmers who do things a little bit differently so that is a cool fact the fragrances that they have is called love high get a room almost single Fuck Mondays, About Last Night, and Bitch Please. All fragrances are vegan and cruelty free. Shut up. They smell so expensive. Ooh, that sounds familiar. That's really, really nice. Oh, wow. And then we also have Fuck Mondays and a deodorant. I feel like Carlos is literally going to love this one. Mmm. It just, every time I smell these, I just like, I'm thinking of like a black room or like a red room. Very mysterious, very rebellious. Definitely, they definitely achieved the rebellious side of, ooh, this is a conditioner? Ooh, a conditioning body wash. This is called Get A Room. Wow. Okay, so this one that I'm smelling is called Love High. First of all, they smell very expensive. Just like imagine 50 shades of gray in a perfume. That's like the best way I can describe it. Ooh, this one, okay, I would say this one is a little bit more girly for me. Very mysterious. Oh my God, they smell so good. Okay, I would say Love High reminds me of like running through New York City with the Christmas lights. Love that. Mm, the bitch please is so calm, very zen. And then get a room. Oh, get a room is very uh, fruity. I think it has apple in it. Oh my gosh, that one is, isn't is as girly. I'll link these down below for you guys. If you guys are looking for new fragrances, definitely check them out. Love, love, oh my gosh. Please get this one. This one's my favorite, morning after. <sighs> but I'm actually really in love with these as well. I'm gonna try these out more. But I'll link it down below for you guys. And make sure you guys use my discount code, KIMTAI, for 20% off. Hello! Hi. It's the next day. It's Wednesday. Jocelyn and Brian already showed up to the house. And we are going, first of all, we came home last night and we died. Died. We passed out, you guys. We are actually gonna go grab something to eat right now. We're eating at this bun gun place, which is like little noodles. And then we're gonna grab everyone bun me. Because my mom cannot use her kitchen right now. So mm -hmm. I want to make sure I feed my family. And then we have to go to Target. And we have to pick up something from Home Depot. So eventful day. And then I think we're going to spend the rest of the night at my mom's house. Putting things together. I'll explain when we get there. And then I'll give you guys a sneak peek of the kitchen. I don't think a lot is getting done today. At the end of the night, their goal is to make it white. So right now they're sanding everything off. And then tonight, I'm bringing Kicking Crab to Michelle's house. Which I'm really excited about. Because I don't Maiden's never had sausage rice and cucumbers. No. Oh, we'll have to buy cucumbers, Mom. Okay. You should put that on the list. Okay. Do you have a list? I'm going to call Oma and let her know in a bit, and I'm going to ask and see if she has... Because she gets Persian cucumbers. Oh, perfect. Okay, yeah. So that is our plan. Right now, we're going to grab lunch. Yummy. <laughs> Michelle got egg noodles. It's so good. Hi, Mommy. How's it going? Oh, the Good. thing fell. It fell. Hi. Hey. How are you? Hey. Oh, standing's good. Branches are coming soon. Yeah. It's just standing. Surprise. Okay. <laughs> I had a baby. <laughs> oh my god. Did she oh. cry when you got her ear pierced? Hi. 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 I love oh baby hats with ears on them. I don't like the pages anymore. Only those. They're like only pages with ears. Look at her little ears. 
She's chilling because she ate already. Diaper change. She's like, just give me all the tape. We go. Hmm. What is on? Yeah, it's so quiet because yeah, Sophia's so at quiet. school. Um, so. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at how pretty the natural Wow, is, that is so pretty. It's red oak. Yeah, and it's, it's solid. I was telling everyone, I was like, under this is actually real, like, really good oak. I know, it's really nice oak. Oh my god. I want her so badly, Jocelyn, what? to move her microwave because it's so big. And look at all the counter space she has without... Where can we move it? Because look how much counter space my mom has how without the microwave. You, you can't... You saw it. It's on the is dinner table. No, yeah, that, but there's no okay. plug. But Brian can make the little thing yeah. plug. That's what I made him do at my house. I oh, really? Plug, I was like, I don't... But I don't think it'll fit. The microwave is yeah, huge. I know. I was like, Mom, I'm considering getting you a new microwave. <laughs> A smaller one. And I was thinking, oh, like, I was like, hey, like, do or we put a little table? <laughs> put well, microwave. friend, I was like, do we put a little table? And then the microwave can go there? But then it's going to be, like, so low. You think so? Yeah, it's going to look off. Oh, yeah. Her microwave I don't know. is massive, though. Is yeah, massive. and it takes up all the counter space. Oh, my God, no. You can get her a waist. I have a way smaller one than that one. But, like, it takes up all the counter space. You can get her one that's like this. Right, thing. right? Like this. That's what I was thinking. That will be good. This looks great. So, sanding's not that bad. What about the red? Is the red super crazy? No. Not really. So my sister. But you know what Brian told me? Huh. I was like so annoyed. I was like seriously. So Why? I was standing. I was trying to get. I was standing to get out of the table, right? To get yeah. completely the red off. Yeah. And Brian was like, no. Just sand it. Get it smooth because uh -huh. we're gonna put a primer on it, and the primer is gonna cover all the red as long as. It's oh my god! So you were like working super hard. Oh. So then I'm like, okay, well, good thing you told me because I was able to get it off all right. I'm just happy that you guys took the red off. I'm so happy. This is great. We love it. Oh, this is going to be beautiful. So, while the kitchen's being done, Jocelyn, Michelle, and I have decided. Gigi's out. What? She's out. Oh. <laughs> Gigi, too. She, uh, dang girl, <laughs> dang. She says she used a lot of her brain cells to decorate this room. Yeah. We've decided to organize this room for my mom without her asking. Um, <laughs> so we've all decided that it would look better if this long couch was on the wall. And then we moved all this towards the window and look how much room she already has, you guys. Cause before it was, it was squish. Now we're gonna move this table. We're very excited. Hey. <laughs> We'll push this out. Out where? Over there? Just over there so we can curve the oh, couch. Okay. Cool. I think new pillows would be nice. Yeah. I'm not sure how about how I feel about the zebra. Didn't you also say you had it? Um yeah, so my mom's had like some of these pieces for 25 years. How close are you? Oh yeah, it's so easy to move at my mom's house. I know with the floor. Yeah. You don't know how oh, like a white couch is looks so nice. I know, right? You can try to get rid of your couch and put it here. Okay. I thought about it for like five seconds. But then she would want to keep this and then she would like literally put it like and right there. And then she there. would board it and put yeah. it in the garage. And then... <laughs> oh. This looks so much better. Where are we putting the ottoman? This rug, this rug is pretty cute too. Target. Yeah. Cute. I just yeah, it doesn't fit, but it's cute. Do you want it? Oh, for outside your outdoor patio. Brian, Brian, like, no, no, like it. I like it. It's Target. It's Studio like, like, like it. I like it. Okay, ready? Michelle? I'm telling you, it's upside down though. Yeah, like what it. is the rug? Really? Yes. This is the right side. Oh, I did. Okay, okay I need upside down. <laughs> Oh my god, my fucking back! <laughs> We're supposed to look with your legs, not your back! Free! That vibe is already cute. That vibe. A rug? Is this for her kitchen? Yeah, yeah, I got her a new rug. Ooh. Yeah, I was like, we're not gonna BS this kitchen. Cool. You're like, I am not doing this. No. We did oh, not this? work. See? It's a vibe. Okay, it's getting places. Legs, not yeah, and then lift with your legs. Don't go upright from your back. Go like this. Um, <laughs> okay, ready? Like you're squatting. Like you're squatting. Put all, yeah, put, put all your <laughs> strength into your heels. Pick okay, up your heels. Okay. What's the front? This one. Yeah. This. 
Yeah. Looking good. Mm -hmm. Does that look good? Does it need to be centered? Mm -hmm. Cause I'm picking it up again. To the far left. This way? This way a little bit. Really? It's like a tiny bit. What do you guys think? I'm more sure. this way. Really? You, you got funny. funny. It's your you eyes. You know funny is you're on that side and I'm on this side. Oh. <laughs> you guys look. Yeah. Yeah. So much better. We have room. For parties too. Remember when it's right here? Yeah. It's so annoying oh. with the table. I'm so excited. I'm all excited. Can you look at it? Let me help you. Just push it down, girlfriends. Tell me it worked. I don't think so. No, oh, just leave it there then. No, but it's fine. Like, it's tucked away. It's like trying to put like the jeans off, but they don't fit. <laughs> Brian is showing Ashley his shoes. Yeah, he's showing me his shoes. Oh, I got the shoes. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.
subscribe to Thea's channel, you guys. My daddy makes custom furniture. <laughs> Brian is working hard. My mom's upstairs. I said she wasn't allowed to be down here. But Brian is putting in new hardware. I think the old one, or new, no, new faucet. The old one was uh, silver or something. So I got her this on Amazon. It'll match the kitchen better. And the cabinets are going up. We have the cabinets going up here. If you guys remember, this is the old hardware from my house when we first moved in. We had these, so I gave that to her. And then we are going to change these outlet thingies. It's coming along. It's so bright right now. What is your thing, you can do basic stuff. <laughs> Everyone's running around trying to get this done. What the door? Yeah. I'll take the photo and then we can finish and then we can show her at the end. Because it's so awkward if you show her and then you're like, okay, oh, you can't go in. You can't go in yet. We have to finish. <laughs> Looks so good on camera. Wow, not in person. I'm cheating. No, it looks amazing in person, but like. Clem, what do you think? What do you think, Clem? And you're not gonna close them, right? No, no, no. Okay. Look at the new curtains. Or no, blinds. Shades. The blue shades. Shades. Blinds. 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 I thought these are blinds. <laughs> They're so beautiful, and then the flowers. Oh my god, she's gonna freak. <laughs> Okay. Oh my god, it's not the same kitchen! Yeah, it's not. <gasps> you guys! It's so pretty. <gasps> oh my lord. Mm. <laughs> the little things count. Pernilla! You look pretty in this kitchen. Hey, you look good. Come on, Mama. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank